Well, this morning, communities, they are assessing the damage after Idalia. Now, President Biden is promising some federal assistance for a full recovery. NBC's Bree Jackson has the very latest. Cleanup is underway after Idalia left a path of destruction along the southeast United States. We weren't prepared to lose all of this. President Biden will get a first-hand look at the damage when he travels to Florida Saturday. He announced the trip during a visit to FEMA headquarters. You know, I'm here to thank all of you, and I really mean this. Thank you. Governors also praising state and local responders for their efforts. There's a lot of resources being put on this on this mission to be able to get them up, up and running as quickly as possible. Amazing response. They've gotten a lot done. Utility crews from across the country are helping to restore power. We are working 24 hours a day and we will be on the job until we get everybody's lights back on. Lawmakers return from recess next week, and President Biden is urging Congress to approve more disaster relief money. We need this money done. We need this disaster relief request met. We need to do it in September. We can't wait. The president requesting $12 billion to ensure that FEMA can help communities impacted by disasters recover. Some Republicans criticize President Biden's request for more disaster funding because it's also tied to providing more aid for Ukraine. In Washington, Bree Jackson, NBC News.